Oh, it started! What's up, motherfuckers? I'm back again. I just got this new software. I actually just literally just stopped down downloading it. This one's a new one's called Flashback right here. It's by um, Blueberry Software. Uh, just starting testing it out right now. Um, hopefully this one works a little bit better than the last things I've tried. I've been trying numerous different software versions all day. And this is probably about the fifth one I've done. Downloaded and uninstalled all those over and over and over. Shit, so fucking, of course, I actually did keep this one. This is the first one I used for that video before. Because it worked even though it had that feedback issue, the camera issue. It still does completely record where it needed to and does not have a limit. That's what I do like. So, um, so I'm just gonna pause the video real quick right now. I'm gonna listen to it and I'm gonna see just exactly how it sounds, if everything sounds okay. Um, several times I've played, I've done recordings and played in the back myself and Basically, I, I sound like a chipmunk a little bit even more than I do right now. <clears throat> um, excuse me. I know I sound like shit right now. I sound like a fucking little kid, but, um, I mean, I'm hoping that this one doesn't do that again, so I'm just going to pause real quick right now and re-listen re to this and see how bad it is. Okay, looks good. Okay. It sounds alright. I'm sorry about the video. I just realized I had my frames down to about fucking 10 FPS and my, uh, yeah, yeah, quality was fair. It was like a tick below maximum, so turned everything back up. My frames back up to 30 for the video for my camera right now, so hopefully everything is going to be all right this time. So, so far the sound sounds all right. I mean, my voice is terrible. I hate my voice, but um, at least you can hear it. So, all right. So I'm, today I'm going to be trying to do a little bit of Roblox. See how terribly this runs. How slowly it does. If it affects the quality of the gaming too much or the uh, speed of the game uh. <clears throat> so yeah I guess I'm gonna guess I'm gonna find out how bad it is was I've actually fucking played this same exact game about four times already and deleted every single video because I realized there were issues so I was smarter this time and decided to actually test this out before I decided to record anything so it seems like it's alright so far. There's so many different fucking recording softwares I've tried over time that just doesn't help me. I'd optimally like to use Bandicam again, but it does cost money to get the free version without watermarks and things. This one, as far as I know, doesn't have a watermark or a time limit, but it might end up having one. And I'll guess I'll find out as I play, or I'll find out when I try to publish. It also weird. The weird thing about this is it saves the saves it in a different format. So the uh, annoying thing about this one is that the format it saves it is um .fbr, which I'm gonna hopefully I can use my converter for that. Have an adapter converter to try to use. Hopefully it'll let me change this to an MP4 video. If not, then I'm gonna have to fucking figure something else out because I really can't publish a video if it's a this format. Um, it still is a video, so technically it should be able to be transmitted into a different format, so um, hopefully it works. Um, Alright, so here's this obby. This is called the Exploration Obby. It's ME, which is Mountain Exploration, which you can probably see um, right in here. Um, if you guys are wondering, that little circle thing I just did, if you get a Windows 10 computer, once you actually download Windows 10, I don't remember if it's in the creators or an insider update or not, or if it's in the regular updates now. That if you um, you can program it to hit control, and it'll show you where your mouse is. So it'll have a little circle thing come up. And that way, your mouse ever disappears in like a white screen or something, you can find it. And it also does adapt the uh, does adapt the contrast, so you can see it even if it's in a straight white area. Because like right now, it's all white, but you can still tell slightly. It does slightly change the tinting of it if you look really closely. It does change the color just enough that you can still see it. Like, and that's red, so of course you can still see it. But on the campsite word right there, it really goes way too quickly to really do it to really tell. But it works enough. There's enough difference in the contrast that so you can still see exactly what's going on. So, this is a game I've played before. I've actually played this one and the previous version of this. I mean, in the next version, I mean, I've completed both of them. It's a really fun game. I really love the um, designs in it. 
pretty fucking cool. I like the uh, idea they pretty much stayed within the theme the whole time too. With how both of them it's in mountain exploration or just exploration period. I really like the idea of it. Everything still goes along with, you know, it's in water, or in caves, or lava, and fucking, you know, it's still, it's all pretty earthy, I guess. It's pretty good, pretty good game. I really like the designs in it so far. I've really enjoyed the second one a lot, too. They, they actually give you a uh, torch, torch in the second one, which definitely helps. There's certain parts where you can find um, hidden badges, and fucking, it's really hard to do if you can't, if you don't know where they are. And I haven't gotten all the badges yet either, I've only got like maybe four of them. So, so right now as you can tell this game isn't lagging as terribly as the fucking last time I did an obstacle course game. Hopefully it's not gonna have this loud, loud annoying chirping beat noise when I finally get to publishing. Just like that previous one did. So, right now it's not lagging too bad, I hope I'm not gonna jinx myself. But this fucking sounds, seems pretty good right now. Luckily I'm the only one playing so it's not gonna lag too much from other people either. So it's fucking, it's pretty good. I think most of the other people are in the second version right now, so. so well, let's see. I, mean, I like to see the neon colors and stuff. I really like the coloring of it too. This is really cool. To, um, there's different parts of this game where you actually have to swim through areas. Um, there's like an oil spill part. So a few different things. It's like a lot of different dynamics you to see. So they did a really good job with it, and I really like these type of blocks, these like white things in the middle, it's really neat, I like the way it glows, it looks pretty cool to me. So this shit should be, this shit should stay recording for me as long as I leave it, um, because it's already been, you know, five and a half minutes, so I guess in five more minutes, let's see if it stops itself, if not, then I guess I'm good. Some of them will record for 15 minutes or 10 minutes, and some will be 45. Hopefully this won't take me any more than 45 minutes, so I wouldn't have to find out, or, you know. It has before, I believe the first time I did it, it did. I fell off, and that was my fault, obviously, but... That is one bad thing I hate. That definitely is not... That, it does that every once in a while. Once you spawn, if you... Yeah, it kinda doesn't give a fuck. You just get flung, and you just had to wait until it stopped doing it. That time I, I just held jump long enough that it didn't kill me all the way, but still, I, I, that's not a fucking fun part. It never did that the first time when I played this, so. Oh well. I'm here now. I'm still I'm alive. Fucking fuck that part up. Alright, let's go. Let's try this again. The same one I just died on, alright. And that thing right there, that fucking, that little, that thing, whatever that is right there, they actually, the person that created the game, they left a comment in the description of somewhere, I can't remember where, they said that that's actually supposed to be some kind of a symbol for, uh, as far as like a, um, a cave painting type thing, the exploration and all that, and the cave paintings, supposed to be like a symbol for that, so, it doesn't look too cool, but I mean, I guess it's an interesting design. You know, I mean, for all the work you had put into the, into the game in the first place, I'm pretty sure that most of the stuff that is in this game was customly made for the game because it's just like difficult, uh, a very difficult thing to do. Like difficult to have all the right textures match and everything without like, you know, finding something that's off a little bit. So it seems so far everything I've played, everything I've seen in here has been pretty, pretty similar texture wise. This, this right here is actually not me running, it's just like a treadmill, it's a uh, conveyor belt thing that's just underneath me. You just can't see it. Because you can't actually run in this. There's only four um, portions of this, and there's the fucking the summit's the fifth one, so once you get to the summit, then you can actually teleport to the second version of the game, which the part two, which I'm gonna do a whole separate video thing for it. So this one's literally I'm just gonna do all of the parts of this one, all of the different sections of this one, and then it'll go I'll go to part two. And do a whole separate video for that. Ouch. That wasn't so fucking ass. I'm so close to the end. That was a little bit of a lag there.
and we will clean that portion of it. There's actually a um, badge up top of there. I've actually already got in and got that and climbed up that ladder right there. And these little blue things are the little badge right there, so. I've already gotten that one. Another thing I like about this is the way that you still have to do a little bit of an obstacle course to get to the next part to be able to teleport into the next uh, level or the section. The next section of it. Whatever the hell you call it. You still have to do a little bit of a jumpy type shit to be able to get into it just like that and I fucking died. I was right in front of it too. That right there is it. That golden thing. Ouch. Fuck. The main way I can think to not kill myself is to jump just as I spawn. I want to get a app that I can actually show the keystrokes as I play because it would be helpful if you can actually watch what I'm doing. I think there might be a way that I can show the keyboard at the bottom of my screen, but it would be for a touch interface keyboard, and I don't know if it highlights the keys when I type regularly or not. I guess that's something that I'm gonna have to try. See if it works or not. If not, then it's whatever. I'll just deal with it. But yeah. Okay. Did he need to touch the wall for that one? Okay, so there's part two. That's the maze. I've actually already taken a picture of that same maze and brought it up already. I can't find where it was though. But, um,. I don't know if you guys have ever seen MW Snap before. Um, it doesn't want to load, apparently. Um, but basically, I also just do this. Okay. I've done this map enough times I should have memorized it already, but I don't know. This maze is. My picture is coming up. Oh, here it is. Okay, let me just back into the open. 
once I open the folder, I will have the other picture I took in the first place in the folder, so... I just had to do that so I can get back to the folder, I don't remember what name it is. This is the picture. Put the load. I open all the screens, so I just hold on a minute. Had this in here. This is the first time. Not a mouth. This is the only way to this exit. Here we go. 1712. My recording didn't stop. Surprise. So it looks like I'm not gonna have a timeline with this one. I hope not, there's some shit I really don't want to have to deal with. This software is working pretty well, I like this one so far. All it takes is somebody to fucking do it right for once. It's like a shit that would make me eventually actually want to buy it. I don't want to buy it if there are pieces of shit about it, they don't want to let you even practice using it and test out all the actual of it before you purchase it. So what if you purchase it and don't like the shit and just fucking waste it for money for no reason. It's like making money off the toy. Or tap or whatever the fuck you do. I really like the idea of these things too, these little glowy, blocky things. I like those white lines in the middle. I might have said that already. But we probably fucking get them slow as fuck. Maybe we should know that already. So there's that shit. So I'm just fucking gonna crump up this fucker. Let's do this part. Slings terrible, my face terrible, my voice terrible. Oh god, tell me. Uh-huh. Oh, 
yourself anyways. Fuck this game. Alright, I did that part. Let's fuck with that color too, I hate this part. Of course not that difficult. The fucking boulder parts are the difficult ones. You know what I'm talking about a little bit if you haven't played this. Yeah, there's some fuckers like fucking Indiana Jones shit with that jump away from the boulders and hide behind little rocks. The boulders will jump over you and I get to fucking stay out the way. This is easy at all. What is this? Oh, it's just... Last time I was playing this, there was a dude that was playing with me. He actually, we were like taking turns waiting up for each other. And, uh, he eventually decided he's gonna leave me. And, you know, when I fell and died for a fucking third time or so, he just stopped leaving and fucking left me even though I waited for him every damn time. I guess it doesn't matter. He just wanted to use me to get through the maze, because, you know, I knew my way through. Obviously, he had the thing up, but still, you need to follow the lead, fucker. Didn't say you couldn't do that. Oh, you could left the picture of the maze there in the first place. What the fuck?! Whoa, 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 what the fucking shit was that? What the fuck, game? Damn, what the fuck? On that one though, I guess. That's cool. I don't know how you even managed to do that. I can't either again. Oh my there it goes. I've been biting my lips every time I do that. More fucking levels, I think it's like 30. There's like 30 some levels, and that's it. It's fucking good. It's fucking good. 
I can do it. It's only been 23 minutes, 24 minutes. so many times in this game. Kind of got the hang of it now. I like the movement a little bit better in this. It's like it's a little bit smoother. Plus the fucking lag is here but it's not as terrible as the other games are. The lag is still existing but it's not ever die. Another thing about these, you can actually jump past most of the blue stripe pieces on these you can just jump past them. Few of them you can't, but for the most part you can just find a way around or just only make one jump over instead of having to jump back and forth over them. Same with the part up here, it's fucking, there's like blue stripes stuck in the uh, on the blocks, you have to jump over and around and all that, so you don't really need to jump all over them every time, you can just take another block to the side or something. Because you, you're being can jump high enough, so you don't really have to go all the way only on the ones with the blue stripes on them. Probably can't hear everything I'm saying because my voice is kind of stupid and sounds like shit and my uh, microphone isn't the greatest. But I'd rather not use an expensive ass microphone for this because kind of afraid I'm, I would break it. Raging. Apparently, it's not this part of the game, that's the part of the game. Bring a friend of scouting with you tonight. I don't have any friends.
Just pay holes me? Not really. Fuck that. So shit. Ouch. Motherfucker, really bitch, fucking had lag and fucking confuse me. But as one has the motherfucking big rocks I need to get past. Yelp this one, I hate this one so much. Shit.
Can't really roast it though. But yeah, so that about that's about it for this video. Um, thanks, block. I knew already. That's about it for this video. Um, honestly, I really don't care about this type of game anymore. It's just kind of. I mean, I don't really care about this. This.